Welcome back YouTube to Rick's YouTube channel and in this video I'm going to be removing the processor off my old PC. Now it's a pretty old PC, the processor is uh, an Intel i5, I forget what chip it actually is until I uh, have a look at it. It's not seen the light of day for about four years so the thermal paste has probably had it. I'm going to remove the, uh, the fan. For anyone that's interested, uh, this is a Gigabyte. Mobo, uh, it's a GAH61M DS2DVI. It's pretty small, it's pretty old, and I've had it for years. So I'm just going to remove the processor now. What I've got to do is test these. Around. Unplug the fan. One final twist, and there we have it. Just have a quick look at the thermal paste. As you can see, it's pretty uh, grim. Still pretty wet. That's what the paste looks like. Let's have a look at the, the CPU. Let's move the catch. Take this chip out. So we have the CPU out. Uh, what I'm going to be using to clean it is some uh, some cotton wool, some. Uh, Isopro alcohol and uh, Q-tip. I'm going to just use a, a wet one. Hold the chip and just try and clean as much as I can off using a wet one. Wet wipe, baby wipe, whatever you want to call it. Holding the chip like that. Probably get a better look at it now and it does actually say it's an intel i5 3340 3.1 gigahertz so i don't know if you actually see that but that's what the chip is served me well over the past few years i'm still going to use this pc probably to uh just edit a few videos but now is on to the stock fan that was on the pc same again just get a wet wipe, just get the rest of that thermal paste up. It's not too bad, I thought it was going to be really sort of like quite hard and crusty, but it weren't too bad. Nice and clean. Now I'm going to get the rubbing alcohol, let's get a cotton bird, tip it up, let some of it soak in. Start off with the the fan. You have it, one clean CPU. So I'm going to wait for that to dry. You can see it evaporating. Once that's all evaporated, we're going to put some thermal paste on it. And put it back on the mobo so i've just put the chip back in the way you put these intel chips or this old chip in let me just remove it again it does have the arrow there but it has two little like noggins there one there you can see and one on the other side so you just line it up and it just drops into place i'm going to put this lever back down now for the thermal paste now I'm going to drop the fan back in place
Yeah, it's back on, it's plugged in, it's all clean. Uh, remember, if you're using cotton wool to clean the CPU off, it does leave fluff everywhere so be very careful using that make sure you get none on the pins or intel this intel chip doesn't have any pins but just make sure you don't get any in where the cpu has to go into because you'll be spending the next 10 minutes to try and getting them out the holes remember if you like the video leave a like subscribe and drop a comment in the comment box below let me know if you enjoy these videos thanks for watching